Guys, it's Joshua from Vans, and I'm just putting together this preview video walk around for you on this Audi A5 Sportback. Now, what I tend to do in these videos is just a general preview of the interior, the exterior, and the spec of the vehicle. If you do get the end of the video and it looks like a sort of thing you're looking for, then just let us know. We'll then put together a further in-depth video walkthrough that will cover any and all imperfections in a bit more detail for you. So, let's jump in, tell you a little bit more about the car. Now, this one's a 2014 on a 64 plate Audi A5 Sportback. So the Sportback meaning is the five door car, okay? Um, it's covered just coming up to 75,000 miles, okay? It is the S line, two litre diesel. Um, so with the S line, obviously, it comes with some nice cosmetic bits on the outside. But the spec on the inside does have some nice optional extras as well. So as I jump in, I'll go around and tell you about those. So jumping straight in, you do benefit from having a front and rear parking sensor on this model, okay? Now the car comes with, let's have a look at the 18 inch alloy wheels. 18 inch alloy wheels, so the 18 inch S line alloy wheels, okay? As you can see there, uh, five wheel car, and you probably notice it does have a sunroof, but you don't see many of them with a sunroof, so a nice little bit to have. Carrying on around the vehicle then, it comes with the reverse parking sensors, and for those of you who've caught on, you do have a little reverse camera as well from factory back there. You have twin exit exhaust at the back, which look very, very nice. And then we're back around your front end. As you can see, it's a very, very nice thing. It's been very well kept and that's backed up by the condition of the interior, which I'm going to show you now. So jumping in, um, you've got full black leather interior, S-line badged interior. As you can see, have cleaned up very, very nice. Um, your mats are all looking, they're all original, all looking in very good condition. Um, and then I'll touch on the spec of the driver's side shortly. As you can probably see there, you've got privacy glass on the, all of your back windows as well, okay? Jumping into the back, you'll see the back seats are looking in just as good conditions. You have Isofix uh, fitments on two outer seats. You've got a central pull-down for your rear passengers. Armrest and sometimes a couple of, so just armrest, okay? In the back there then, you've got heated seats for the rear passengers as well, which is a lovely option to have. You don't find many of those with that option on. Jumping in then. So you've got plenty of boot space, plenty of head space as well while using it. Now this might look strange, but for some of you guys, it's going to be important selling point. So it's a detachable tow bar. Okay, so it comes with two keys. Okay, so that'll obviously fit onto the back, uh, but that will be provided with the car as well. Uh, but the boot itself then, as you can see, all looking in very nice condition. 12 volt socket charger there. You've got a little compartment, which, is, which has likely got all your spare wheel kit, etc. Another little view then on the driver side. As you can see, same story over here. Very, very nice condition on all of the seats. And then here we jump in to the driver's side. Now, what I tend to do with this part of the video is just jump in and give you a quick fire of the spec on the vehicle. So, you have heated and adjustable wing mirrors there, okay? Electric windows. A couple of different driver's seat adjustments found there. Automatic lighting, okay? And then there's a little view of your cockpit as such with your sunroof there. Lovely day for a sunroof as well. Now, jumping in, we're currently on 74,924 miles. So, shut that. Starts on the button, as you can see, runs and drives spot on with no warning lights. Okay, now in terms of your spec, so you've got a multifunctional steering wheel here, you've got some media functions and your voice command function just at the top there. And then on this bit is how you go through your interactive dashboard, okay? So Bluetooth settings, uh, trip computer, fuel economy, all of that sort of stuff is found on that interactive dashboard. Onto your centre console then, okay? So as you can already see, it does come with integrated sat-nav, okay? You've got plenty of other different options, car, telephone, information, media. So you've got Bluetooth media and phone connectivity on here as well, okay? Uh, radio, let's have a look, what have we got? Yeah, DAB radio on here as well. Comes with a reverse cam. Again, a lovely option to have on this as well. Uh, moving down then, of course, you've got your, your CD player there. You've got your parking sensors, traction control, automatic stop start. You have driver and passenger heated seats on this car as well. I'm going to turn them off because it's quite toasty in here. It comes with the all-important air conditioning, of course. You've got your automatic climate control there, so lots of different options to play with there as well, okay? It's a six-speed manual transmission. A couple of little bits of storage and things up there. Electric handbrake. And then, obviously, these are all your buttons to navigate through your centre console. Um, but aside from that, storage, some more power behind there glove box there's all your sunroof all working as well just a very very nice well-equipped car in fairness so let us know your thoughts and anything further i can do to help just give us a shout and i'll be more than happy to help thank you very much for watching cruise control there as well i forgot to say but yes <laughs> thank you for watching take care bye bye